All right. <clears throat> I wanted to make this video to, um, I don't know, talk about this friendship that God created for me um, in real life. Um, you know that war that warrior with the heart of gold that I told you about, that Christian that has a heart of gold? Colossus, I call him. <laughs> yeah. He, uh, God's utilizing him to help me, you know what I mean, along this path, for sure. And it's been a, it's been a good friendship so far, you know what I mean. Um, I would say he's farther along as far as um, his walk with God and stuff. He's farther along for sure. <laughs> God knows I'm still like, <laughs> You know, like tentative, you know. I'm not a hundred percent believer. <laughs> I'm like gung ho, you know. Like like he is, you know. But he keeps telling me like God has more thoughts of, of me than the grains of sand. I don't know if that's in the Bible. I'm like, how could you possibly have that many thoughts about me? How is that even possible? <laughs> no joke, you know what I mean? That's, that's, a, that's a crazy statement. I'm like a transformer. There's more to me than meets the eye. Thou, all those thoughts you can think about me? Well, I'm a transformer. There's more to me than meets the eye. You know? You can have all those thoughts about me. <laughs> Magdalene, no thoughts about me, no thought. just kidding, <laughs> I've embarrassed you enough, all right, I've embarrassed you enough, and myself, all right, anyway, but, uh, but anyways, enough about that, I always get sidetracked with the lovey-dovey kind of stuff, sometimes, Back to the story. This is true, though. He keeps utilizing this friendship with Colossus. We have similar backgrounds. We had a hard go. <laughs> Let's, I'll just say that point blank. We both had a hard go. And, like, God came to save us both, you know, from ourselves. You know, God's still trying to save me from myself still. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I can relate to Colossus, you know what I mean? We struggle in this world. We do. Me and Colossus struggle in this world. Well, he's doing pretty well right now. But in the past, he, you know, things were worse. <laughs> but um, he made me realize that I'm more healthy than I think I am. <laughs> I still don't think I'm a healthy person. I still don't think so. But. God's trying to convince me I am. I'm a healthy person, apparently, still. Somehow. With pain issues, CPTSD stuff, trauma, doesn't matter. God doesn't care. I'm healthy as hell, you know? So I, if I believe I'm healthy, I'm healthy. You know what I mean? <laughs> I told you. Mary Magdalene, don't think about me. I told you not to. I can tell you're thinking about me. Don't do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm just making stuff up in my head, as always. It's a great time. of the X-Men team are over YouTube. <laughs> One of them is in real life. Colossus, the tenth member of the group. <laughs> yep. You guys haven't met him yet, but <clears throat> God's utilizing him. <laughs> I always think of that book in the Bible, Colossians. Yeah. <laughs> when I think about him, you know, Colossus, Colossians, you know. It's fitting. It's fitting, you know what I mean? For sure. They made a book about 
Colossus. That makes sense. That makes sense. They made a book about him. That makes sense to me. Yeah. But anyways, it's been interesting how God has been talking to me through him. It's been interesting. He speaks in tongues. I'm like, I've, I've never spoken in tongues. He's a big believer in the speaking in tongues thing. I thought it was just nonsense from day one. I did. <laughs> but I know, I know I've always thought, it always felt like English wasn't my first language. It always felt that way my whole life. <laughs> you know what I mean? I know it's weird. First language I've learned on this earth doesn't feel like my first language. You know what I mean? So maybe the speaking in tongues is my real language. I don't know. It's interesting. <laughs> but yeah, it's freaky how much God knows about me. More than anybody else. It's kind of freaky how much he knows about me. Someone that knows me more than I know myself ever in this lifetime, God knows me better. It's freaky as hell. <laughs> it is. No joke. But yeah, enough about that. <laughs> I always worry about stuff. Somehow God's made things happen to work out over and over and over and over. Why do I even doubt? I don't know. I don't know. God's ruining my story. You know, instead of me crashing and burning, he's he's like having a, a happy story. You know? It's interesting. Today again, I'm like, put my trust that Jesus knows what he's doing. <laughs> put my trust in what knows what he's doing. <laughs> he's the real king in all this, you know? <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know. But yeah, that's just what's been going on lately. It's my friendship with Colossus. You know what I mean? <laughs> he thinks I'm all right. Yeah, I think I'm an all right guy. He thinks I'm all right. Yeah. Sometimes it's different when it's like someone that thinks you're all right. You th you're a cool dude in real life rather than just over the internet. You know, it's different. It is. It makes a difference. I think God knows that. If someone in real life thought I was a cool dude, for real, it could change the way I see myself entirely. You know what I mean? The battle acts with self-esteem? What? <laughs> with real self-esteem? What the, you know? That's what God wants. He wants me with self-esteem. <laughs> Confident. So confident battle acts. You know? I'm getting there, but trying to do God's will is exhausting. If you've ever tried to do it, if you ever try to do what God wants, it's exhausting. Instead of just doing what you want, you know, like whatever pleasure you want to do in life, put that to the side. You're doing what God wants. It's kind of exhausting. But it's worth it in the end, I guess. He says. <laughs> but yeah. Me and Colossus. You know, the, the Wolverine. The Wolverine and Colossus. 
back to back, working together. God hasn't, God hasn't steered me wrong yet. That's each stage. That's what Colossus is talking about as well. God knows the timing of each stage I'm at. The timing to do what God wants to do at each time. His stage of me. Each stage of forming the act. By the time God's done with forming the axe, it'll be too late for the people. <laughs> it'll be way too late. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Instead of saying repent, he's just going to say, I'm going to burn you in about a week. <laughs> <laughs> no joke. That's how it's going to go. You know, instead of, you know, he's like, Telling them to repent isn't working, so I'm just going to tell them I'm going to burn them. See if they believe me. <laughs> I'll burn them in a week and see if they believe me. So that's why I'm that's why I'm here to tell you he's going to burn you in like a week. <laughs> you know what I mean? But wait, uh, don't can't can't I repent? It's way past that time. It's way past the repent time. You know what I mean? It's burn time. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Kinda. <laughs> gonna go home <laughs> god does <laughs> but he's verified in many different ways the burning of the planet will take place it will at some time it will take place the burning of the earth cleansing of the earth it will he'll, he'll, uh, he'll have us uh, i don't know how we're gonna survive it this the people that he wants to survive i don't know how that'll work like i said i don't know But I have a feeling that, that might be a, a long ways from here is when, when he'll do that type of a thing. But anyways. Right now, he has me being friends with Colossus. <laughs> you know, kind of coaching me along the way. So, I hate that I need coaches. I need assistance from other X-Men. I hate that I need help, you know, on this road, but I do. God knows it. I need, a, you know, the Battle Axe is not perfect. Not even close. Battle Axe is not perfect at all. You know? Nope. But God's trying to make me more perfect or something. You know what I mean? Somehow. Somehow they keep working out. You know what I mean? It's like, all right, keep going. <laughs> keep going as things keep working out. You know? <laughs> Just keep, keep living. Like, keep living like things will keep working out as they have been. <laughs> Just keep living. <laughs> you know, I guess that's what I've been doing. <laughs> yeah. Take some guidance from Colossus. Sometimes I get jealous of them. I admit, sometimes I get jealous, you know, like I see this couple in front of me. You know, the battle axe wants to love, you know what I mean? The battle axe wants to be loved by someone besides Jesus, for hell's sake, someone else. You know, a female of some kind. <laughs> Something, you know. God knows I'm like the hardest person to, to love. I am. 
even with me loving myself, it's I'm the hardest person to love. <laughs> but I'm learning, you know. God is taking it very serious. He is. He's taking it very serious with the uh, matchmaking. You know what I mean? Getting me ready. You know what I mean? Which has been hard in itself. You know what I mean? You know. Before, uh, <laughs> basically before a partner is introduced for, I don't know. I've been dating, but dating's not my thing, you know. <laughs> I'm a warrior. Warriors don't know how to date, you know. <laughs> I'm better at being a battle axe, you know what I mean? God knows it as well, you know. The battle axe wants love in the end. The battle axe wants love, you know what I mean? I do, I admit it, you know. Everyone wants to be loved and, you know, by someone else besides Jesus, you know, someone else, you know what I mean? I mean, he's all right, but, you know, it's like, that's all I have, you know, just Jesus forever, you know. I guess, you know. Everyone's like, all you have is Jesus for the most part, you know. Some of you guys as well. <laughs> but for the most part, just cat girl, you know. <laughs> I keep trying to get him to work a job so we, he can help me pay the bills, you know. Jesus, you know, we're in this together, Jesus. Go get a job as well. I got a job. You go get a job, you know. I'm trying to make money. And, you know, even... Even on YouTube, you know. <laughs> Trying to make my channel more popular, you know what I mean? Just kidding. Be careful what you ask for. <laughs> you know. But yeah. Um, I'm like, Jesus, get a job. Help me out with the bills. <laughs> I don't even, I don't even live it lavishly. I don't. I'm all right. I, I keep, somehow keep, things keep working out, so I'm all right. The battle axe is all right for now, you know. One day at a time, stay in the moment, you know. Uh, that's all I wanted to talk about was the friendship that God has formed with me and Colossus. It's interesting friendship, as you can imagine. The Wolverine and Colossus. Interesting, interesting friendship, isn't it? Just thinking about it, the dynamic. It's interesting how God has made some of us like X-Men, different X-Men. That's what I've noticed. He has to make it easier for guys like me to identify different people. Oh, you're like that X-Men. Oh, you're like that X-Men. Oh, you're like that X-Men. But keep it simple for me, you know what I mean? Basics are key always, and that's part of the basics. Whatever X-Men you're closest to, that's who you are <laughs> to me. You know, you're that X-Men, you're that X-Men, you're that X-Men, you know what I mean? <laughs> Keep it simple. <laughs> but yeah, he's definitely teaching me stuff. He is. He's definitely teaching me. He's definitely teaching me. That's a fact. He's more mature than I am. Well, imagine that someone more mature than me. Whoa, that's a big that's a big jump, isn't it? That's I mean that's a hard thing to do to be more mature than me. One day I'll be mature. One day I'll be I'll be my, a mature person. Yeah. But yeah, 
he's maybe he's way more mature than I am for sure. <laughs> but oh well. I can catch up. I can catch up in maturity. Don't underestimate the battle axe. <laughs> Don't underestimate the battle axe. Don't underestimate me. Jesus shows me he can do something. I will try to do it myself. I have. I've been trying to like match it. You know what I mean? Oh, he mastered that. I can master that. Some of the things I still struggle to master. <laughs> that Jesus already mastered. But <laughs> oh well. No one's perfect. Except Jesus, apparently. It's except him. It's, he can stand by that claim. He actually is. <laughs> That's all I want to say. It's the friendship with Colossus. Me and Colossus. It's an interesting dynamic. God knows I haven't had the best. I'm getting better. I'm not the best around uh, men. You know. Males. Because I... Uh, um, I experience the most rage against me. The most violence against me from men. <laughs> I don't know, call ourselves a, call themselves men, but so yeah, I've gotten better around men, but for the for a long time I was afraid of them, the men. And that's another thing God's trying to get me to overcome is my fear of men. So. He's all right. He has a heart of gold, my friends. He has a heart of gold. You know, there was a time where there was like a there was like a spider on the ground. This is the kind of guy Colossus is. Gentle soul, big guy but gentle. You know, there's a spider on the ground. Instead of smashing the spider, he just takes it outside and lets it go. <laughs> That's the kind of guy he is. You know, I mean, he even spares the spiders. Heart of gold, my friend. <laughs> Legit heart of gold. Not just talk. Not just talk. You know. But anyways. It's an interesting friendship. It is, for sure. But I trust I trust Jesus knows what he's doing. I trust he knows what he's doing. When it comes to me, I've come to the conclusion nobody else knows what they're doing. Even me, except for Jesus himself. <laughs> when it comes to me, no one else knows what the hell they're doing. No one does. Of, of how to guide me, instruct me, you know. No one knows what the hell they're doing except Jesus. Because he made me. <laughs> that's how he knows how to, to instruct me. He knows how to, that's how. He made me. He knows how to instruct me. He designed me. He's proving he's designing. He designed me. He's proving it. 